So today's video is going to be a little bit different because in front of me right now is a product that could help me prevent my excessive sweating. It might sound gross for some of you guys, but to be honest, there's a lot of people who are experiencing hyperhidrosis. Hyperhidrosis is the skin condition where you sweat a lot, so it's pretty much excessive sweating. Usually you sweat a lot on the palm of your hands, your armpit, and on your feet. Now I've always had hyperhidrosis ever since when I can remember, and I'm telling you, it is definitely a struggle. It has been a rough life for me. So one day I was scrolling through Instagram and Facebook and I've seen a lot of ads for hyperhidrosis solutions. So this company called Dermadry, or is that what they're called? But I think the product is called Dermadry, but I think that's a company actually. So it's called Dermadry and apparently it helps you from excessive sweating. So I hit them up. I was like, hey, I make YouTube videos. Do you want to partner up? So this video is sponsored by Dermadry and they sent me this product for free for me to try. So even though it's a sponsored video and they gave me this product for free, I'm still gonna give my honest review because like for some many people out there, I experience a lot of excessive sweating and it is definitely embarrassing and it needs to stop, especially when I'm traveling. It is very inconvenient because I'm a travel vlogger, so I vlog all my trips. And every time I touch my camera, my tripod, my gorilla pod, and drone and everything, my hand just starts sweating, especially in a hot climate. Or after, actually, after I drink my coffee, my hand starts sweating, and I hate it. So, um, without further ado, let's go ahead and check out this product. Um, thank you, Dermadryer, for sending me this product. I will link the information on their website down below, so go ahead and check them out. Let's start this video. So let's go ahead, open it up. So the box says that they're Canadian company. I think they're based in Montreal. So right away they have this instruction. Also, it's like a kit. Anyway, well, let's get into that later. Let's read this first because this is my first time trying the product as well. So I don't know what to expect and I don't know what's going on. So this one says stop. So I feel like I need to read this and I never read manuals. Who read? Who does that? Everybody YouTubes nowadays. So dear customer, thank you for buying Dermadry. Please make sure to carefully read the instruction for use before using Dermadry for the first time. Cool. So inside the box is this nice kit. Oh my god, I like this. I like smelling things. <laughs> so I think these are the pods. So I've seen their demo video on their website. And I think this is the pod where you, uh, or the patches, whatever you call this, that you put in your armpit. It looks like this. It doesn't feel, it feels like a sponge ish. And I believe these are the electro thing that you attach, you put in here. Some wirings, the adapter, I think, for power and the device itself it's pretty light it's very compact now i'm always curious every time i try a product that prevents a natural phenomenon in a human body from happening and my first question is is are there side effects but i guess i'll be the guinea pig for you guys i'll try that out i think these are the ones for your hand that i saw on your on the demo video so let's put that aside and oh the two towels so all the products are all laid out on the table. Let me adjust the frame. Dermadry is a tap water ion tho oh that's a big word. Ion to device for single patient use designed for home use. Patient has to be a minimum of 13 years old. You have to be a minimum of 13 years old. Any qualified person, including the patient with a minimum of eight years of education, can be the operator of this device. Refer to warning section. Treatments are performed by applying an electric current onto the targeted skin area. Warnings, do not use this device if you have any of the following conditions. Oh my God, you guys, do, be careful. You need to read this before you buy this or check out the website. If in doubt, please contact your professional. That's the easiest way. There are varying severity levels of hyperhidrosis, excessive sweating. Understanding one severity will help gauge the expected response time before results are seen. So in the treatment schedule, depending on the level of hyperhidrosis, um, there's two phases, the initial phase and the maintenance phase. So the initial phase, you're gonna have to do the treatment frequently, more frequently than the maintenance phase. The maintenance phase is less frequent, fewer treatment every single week and throughout four to six times a week. So for my level, level three, uh, my initial phase would be three to five times per week for about four to six weeks. Oh my god, by the way, this book's telling me that I can use this case as well as the tray. This video is not planned, you guys, so everything is trying it out for the first time as we go. There we go, so now they're detached, so I can use this as a tray. Attach the wires, attach the wires, put it on there. Okay, so that's, I think that's far enough. You're seeing everything in my house now. Okay, step four. 
Connect it connect a cable to each electrode while plugging the other cable and into the connector on the back panel of the controller. So there are two white wires. Um, each wire connects to the electrode. I'm so excited for this. I hope this is n now the solution for my hyperhidrosis. Oh, I forgot to co cover each electrode with a towel. So for 20 minutes while doing this treatment, I'm gonna be watching a YouTube video or something, a movie or something. Connect a cable, I did. Make sure the cables are carefully plugged into the electrode to prevent unstable connection. This may cause current fluctuation or minor electric shocks during treatment. I don't want electric shocks! Carefully fill both treatment trays with enough tap water to, max, to a maximum of 5 ml per tray. 500 ml per tray. So I only filled the water high enough, enough for it to cover the electrode and the towels. So what's next step? I'm so scared. Carefully fill both treatment. Okay, tap water. Yeah. Uh, ensure that the entire skin surface. Ensure that the ensure that the entire skin surface intended for treatment is in contact with water. Use water between room temperature and warm. Uh, okay, according to user format. Okay. Okay, so now let's plug in the power, which I am so scared. Okay, so I set my current strength to only 5 MA because I am scared and it's my first time and it's recommended if you're treating your hand that you only set it to 1 to 15. So literally I'm at the lowest point, like 5, maybe I should put it up to 1. But um, so what I'm gonna do now is press this green, uh, the start button, the on the power button for 3 seconds and then the treatment will begin. Okay, green light flashing. Now I have to put my hands on it, right? If I die. Oh shit. It's happening. Oh my god, I'm feeling current. Okay, so currently it's 15 volt, 5 MA. Um, the amperage is 5. 5 amperage, we're down to 19 minutes now. The only thing is my thumb is tilted sideways, so it's not it's not flat on the surface, if you know what I mean. If you go ahead, try it. Like if you put your palm straight flat down on the table. Okay, there's a little bit tingly sensation. Sensation. <laughs> you guys, I don't know if you can tell, I'm scared. I'm so nervous. Okay, I guess it's not that scary, but I don't know why I'm expecting that all of a sudden this will blow fire or something. <laughs> Yup, tingly sensation, pretty much all over my palm now. Oh, 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 stinging. Okay, let me just relax. Oh my god, shit. That is actually, I guess, killing all the pores. I guess it's killing all my sweat glands, not the pores. Okay, this is real life. I don't know if I'm gonna watch my movie because I want to show you guys what's going on. So I guess this is my first time, Sunday. And then it says my schedule should be 3 to 4 six times per week for initial phase god sensation tingling sensation okay i don't know what the science behind the science behind this but i'm curious killing all my sweat glands right now it's not painful if you're curious it's not painful i wouldn't say as well it's like i wouldn't compare it to somebody poking small little tiny needles on your hand because it's literally not painful you feel those um pins and needles thing it's kind of like that, but not as bad. I'm not doing this for YouTube. I'm doing this for myself because I want to get rid of this sweatiness. Oh, the amperage is going down. Oh, I see. Okay, so now we're back down to zero amperage. Oh, I see. So I saw a graph somewhere in the manual that says that's like there's a high point and low point. So I guess it's slowly going back up now again. So the amperage is going back up to 4 MA. I don't know what's the reason of going back up and back down again, I think to give your sweat gland some relaxation. <laughs> you don't want to kill it all of a sudden. I think that's it. So I'm going to go ahead and watch this show, let you know all my initial review about it. Okay, so that's the end of my first treatment. Uh, I don't know if it did something, but throughout the treatment, like I said, I felt some tingly sensation. It was like a pin and needle type of sens sens sensation, but lesser effect 
I don't know if I'm gonna update you guys throughout the week while doing this I thought about within the 20 minute time span I thought about like how I'm gonna update these people so like maybe I'll just uh, write down in the description box all the updates uh, throughout the week so I could do like week one week two updates and like I said in my schedule I believe I would have to do three to six times three to five times a week for about four to six weeks so mm, that's like two months thank you so much for watching um keep an eye out in the description box for my update throughout the six month update so first week second week and i will let you know as well if the sweating has lessened and i will let you know both my hands and feet thank you so much for watching and i'll see you all next if you are into travel vlogs don't forget to subscribe to this channel as well because i that's what i mainly do in this channel this is just a different video because I wanted to share it to the world. So thank you so much for watching. I will see you all next time. Bye.